Unless you don't have a single pore on your face, guaranteed, hands down, you have dealt with those pesky blackheads and whiteheads. <laughs> I've been there, my friends have been there, pretty much everyone I know has been there. So of course I would go out of my way to do some research and figure out a simple hack that can get rid of all of your black and white heads like this. Don't believe me? Keep watching. Step one, I'm going to remove the makeup on my nose with a cotton round and some makeup remover. There goes my nose contour. And now my nose looks twice as big. Wonderful. And that is not a nose contour line. That would be from my glasses. And yes, for those who don't watch me on Snapchat, I do have a pair of spectacles that I wear when I work. Okay, now that I have removed my nose makeup and nose contour, step two is to steam the nose and open up the pores. So in this container here, I have some steaming hot water and I'm going to set it down on my countertop, put my head over it, not into the hot water because that would be pretty painful. Over it just so the steam can reach my nose and I'm going to put a towel over my head to make sure that I trap all of the steam. And I'm going to do that for five minutes. Now that my face is steamed and my pores on my nose are hopefully open, I'm taking one of these dental flossers. It's a stick with some dental floss on it. And this is what I'm going to use to get rid of my blackheads and whiteheads. Yep. So all you wanna do is take your little flosser and you wanna scrape along your skin like this. And those blackheads and whiteheads should just pop right out. I don't know if you can see that, but I have some juicy little blackheads and whiteheads on the string. I don't have that many of them now because I do this like every third day. The first time I did it, whew, it was not a pretty sight. So this hack is amazeballs. So if you guys are looking for a quick and easy way to get rid of your whiteheads and blackheads, try a dental flosser. You'll thank me later. Hey, can I tell you a secret? If you're subscribed to my channel, you might still be missing out on my content. To make sure you don't miss my next video, click on this little bell icon next to the subscribe button and check off this box to receive notifications from my channel every time I upload a video. Want to see what I'm up to outside of YouTube? Follow me on Instagram, Snap, and Facebook. And don't forget to subscribe. Oh, hello, darling. Would you like a cup of tea and a scone? My sincerest apologies for my horrid English accent, but you know, I was just watching Fleur de Force on YouTube and her accent just inspired me. And now that I'm drinking tea, I thought, you know, I'd give it a go. Yeah. I could never do an English accent if my life depended on it. Luckily, this hack video is not about that. I will not be teaching you how to achieve an English accent because I myself have not figured out a hack to achieve a perfect English accent. Instead, I'm going to be teaching you two epic tea hacks that I'm pretty sure you have not heard of. Now, personally, I am an avid tea lover and so is my husband. We love drinking tea, but some of the teas that we like drinking are caffeinated and sometimes we get sick of drinking drinking the same old teas over and over again. So luckily I came up with two epic hacks to solve both of those problems. So if you are a tea lover just like we are and want to know what my epic tea hacks are, then this video is for you. 